it is called yeah this is where you talk scott you don't even know what game you're about to play for god's sake it's called mad science university and what's it about mad science in a university makes sense okay. Cool. Essentially, essentially, let's just. I guess I'll show you the first few cards. So, this card <coughs> is, an, is an objective. So, um, you've got to see in the dark. You'll have a handful of cards down here, and uh, you have to come up with the best way of seeing in the dark based on one of five cards. Um, so, essentially, the premise is you're in a university. You've got a week to come up with a plan to help people see in the dark. I guess in this scenario, uh, I'd call on the powers of God. Uh, to enable night vision in all using my holy water. I mean, obviously, obviously it would fail, as we all know. But you know, that's that's the point. So, um, and and whoever is the uh, whoever I guess is the teacher decides on on the most appropriate action. So it is the uh, you only get to use one card, yeah. Yep. Right. You have okay. A hand of five. I think that's pretty fucking simple. Everybody get it? Kind of. I, I get it. Cool. Let's do it. What? How, how are you taking five cards don't, at once? Oh, I put the cursor over it and hit the five key. Oh, what? I mean, I type in cheat codes. <laughs> Shit, I've picked up the whole pack. Let's go. Okay, we're putting big head mode on the suit. Oh. All right. Here we go. That's right. I'll do it one by one. <clears throat> uh. Where are you going with those? <laughs> put, them, put them back down. All right, calm down. I'm just trying to get them lined up. Right, there I we be, go. Shall I be lecturer, I guess, first? I think so, yeah. Okay. Today, boys and girls, I would like you to tell me how we're going to manage to pull an all-nighter. Oh, oh, my God. God. Oh, my God. Oh, there we go. I remember. I remember. <laughs> For fuck's sake. How did it's you fine. get into this university? <laughs> yeah, there we go. Oh my God. Okay, well, I guess I'll go first then. Okay. Well, okay, so good. you, we need to have a week to find out how to pull an all-night ear. Yeah? yeah, you've got one week to, to use any of those things at your disposal to get me to pull an all-night I'm old, I'm, I'm struggling a little bit. I have to be in bed by 10. So, oh, you know, man, bless you. I, know. I can saw this. It comes to us all, to be honest. Okay, well, you said you're an old person, yeah? Mm-hmm. You know, I'm guessing you maybe have trouble with your bowels. <laughs> what? Yeah. Most, most old people do. Yeah, why not? Do yeah. They? I mean, most old people are new. Get me for a whole night. But just hold up, listen. Okay. You want to stay up all night. I've got the perfect thing for you. You need, sir, bananas. And you need tons and tons of bananas. Literally all the bananas in the world. And it's going to make you rather regular. So you're not going to want to stay up. You're going to have to. Because you're going to be running to that toilet. Just shitting. <coughs> uncontrollably, Literally filling up your toilet bowl. You're not going to be able to flush the toilet fast enough. And that's going to make you stay okay. up well, all night, honest. sir. I'm going to be honest. I fucking hate bananas. Oh. I detest bananas. Oh. oh. If someone else is eating a banana and I'm sitting beside them, I have to move. They're not that bad, jeez. Well, they are if you don't like them. Well, in Rich's defense, in your constant what? movement, is that it, will keep you, you awake. Like, Indeed. You it, won't be, it won't be sitting on the toilet. It will be bending over the t toilet. <laughs> <laughs> what, what is it you don't like about the banana? Is it the taste? The, 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 banana the texture? The, the phallic symbolism? <laughs> All of the above. He just All hates right. the color yellow, which is why he's always crapping on Sir Night Owl. <laughs> ah, makes sense. That's why I chose him as yellow. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I guess I guess bananas is out of the question then, well, huh? No, you never know. Let's see what else comes up. So, um, principle. I mean I like the it, fact that I like the fact that you didn't mention that bananas are a good source of energy. <laughs> Your whole argument was based on our need to be sitting on the toilet, but you know <laughs> fine. Who, is it just next? yourself that's uh, staying up or is there yeah, a group? Just, there? It's just me. Alright. Have you ever seen the movie um oh what's it called? Angels and Demons? No. No? Is that with uh, Tom Hanks? It is. Well, maybe I have. Yeah, well, in this movie, there's a character who I cannot remember the name of. He's a, he's a priest. Or, or 
monk or something. And he, he does a kind of like a, a religious kind of activity where he um, whips himself. Oh, you're talking about Silas. That's the guy. So. What, from Con Air? Oh, that's Cyrus, sorry. <laughs> so. <laughs> Carry on. Whilst watching this film, as he was whipping himself, I remember thinking, he looks very awake. <laughs> yeah? <laughs> so. This is how you stay awake. You get these whips. And notice that it's plural, right? None of this single-handed stuff. You can dual-wield these whips. And just whip yourself awake. Into you feel yourself seat. nodding off. Exactly. Okay, yeah, no, I see that. That works. You don't have to, I'm guessing he doesn't have to do it in front of a cross either. Like Silas no, does. No, no, no. Or wear a I robe. Mean, he, he could do. Maybe it could be a, 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 I mean, whatever floats your boat. A, but... a biblical statement. Well, More it? so than the bananas. Okay, whips and bananas. What else you got for me, guys? <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> you want to go rubber, or should I go? Um, you know what? I'm going to go because this is going to be really bad. All right. Um, Great. I, nice way to sell it. I present the power of pigeons. <laughs> okay. Um, why? Well, I don't know. you, you want to pull an all-nighter, don't you? Well, at night, pigeons, they coo, don't they? They go, coo, 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 coo. Oh, fucking hell, this is shit. I don't know. Um, <laughs> <laughs> you could feed them at night, I guess. <laughs> uh, to be fair, they are they are <laughs> feisty, aren't they? Like, you know, they're always shagging, I guess. They, So you could uh, watch them and take... Uh, you know, honestly, I'm sorry. I mean, three really, really... <laughs> Fantastic suggestions there. I'll, I'll <laughs> all right. I'll the keep whips all of them in, in mind. Surely. Well, just in case pigeon isn't the option for you, I know that as an elder gentleman, you probably enjoy going out on the town every now and then, getting a nice dance in. And what better for an elder gentleman such as yourself than the tango? Ooh. Now, keeping an all nighter going where you and maybe even some of your closest friends that haven't passed away of old age yet. Uh, come together and just dance the night away. Before you know it, the night's already over. You didn't even have to pull an all-nighter. It just kind of happened around you. Wow. I mean, I'm, I'm I mean, that is about, a strong card. I'm worried about the hips. Yeah. I'm going to be honest with you. I mean, I, I might be up all night, but it might be at A&E. Um, <laughs> exactly. Exactly. Still pulled an all-nighter. <laughs> indeed, indeed. It works. Um, so I think in, I was going to just choose the one I like the best, but I think I might give you ra ratings. Um... Well, I already see our sweet ratings. <laughs> Indeed. I, I, it's like some subliminal messaging it is, is going on very there. Subliminal. Um, you know what? Between the pigeons and the bananas, <laughs> I think I'd rather watch <laughs> pigeons have sex. What? Um, so, Mr. English Gamer, I'm going to give you a. I'm going to give you the D. Oh dear! Oh, <laughs> he does like the D. <laughs> that I'm not going to lie. I think I think pigeons might have to be a C. You could make yourself a pigeon pie at night if you fancy it. I could. Well, I mean, see, that, that could have been a good route to go down. I mean, you, know, you could feed way. yourself. What I would say is this one seems the most versatile. You could send messages I to mean, your mates all at night. shocking options, but this one seems to be the most versatile. Um, between the whips and the tango, you know what? I think, I think the tango sounds like a good idea and actually more fun than the whips, but I think the whips would keep me up more. Um, yes. Because I feel like I'm exerting energy here, whereas here I'm just going for the whole... Yeah. Unless you're whipping yourself, that's going to take a lot of energy. Oh, yeah, that's yeah good point. and to be fair, if you whip yourself, you sometimes get an erection. So that that's a plus. I mean, sometimes. Obviously, you're not doing the tango right. <laughs> 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 um, so, yeah, I guess I guess we're going to go D, C, B, A. Yes! Mr. Night Owl, congratulations. <laughs> you are the world's worst university lecturer. <laughs> Did you expect anything less? No. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Oh. Fix everyone's annoying habits. That's what I need you guys to do for me. How can I fix everyone's annoying habits? Wow. Hmm. <laughs> Annoying habits. Well, what what sort? What are the annoying habits? I guess, I guess we should go around the table and say our annoying habits. Let's start with you, English gamer. <laughs> That's not really around the table, but okay, whatever. <laughs> um, it will my, be once you start. My annoying habit. I like to. Uh, I, I have no idea. I'm pretty perfect. It's got to be said. 
he is pretty perfect. <laughs> Especially when he whispers. I love that. Well, so it's annoying for everyone else that he's just yeah, too right. perfect. And a compulsive liar. <laughs> <laughs> wow. I have this bad habit where I try and fix everyone else's habit. Oh, I see. I mean, that would be... Yeah. Um, okay. Okay. Have you heard... Mr. Teacher, I'm sure you have because you're an intelligent person. Um, have you heard of uh, shock therapy? Of course. Um, you know, I think the best way to to train someone's brain to stop doing something that's annoying is to tell them that's annoying. If they do it again, electric shock. It's a good way to good way to think of it. Yeah. If they do it again, electric shock. So I'm going to harness the power of lightning. Oh, okay. hold, hold on, that's a bit extreme, isn't it? That's not really giving them a little shock, that's just you chucking a thunderbolt at them. And I, think it's, the best. I think it's pretty appropriate. And you don't know how annoying it, it, these habits are. I mean, you've yeah, probably got the most of them. Yeah, if they're gone, you're going to but I, I, I don't want to die either. I'm willing oh, to accept my faults. We'll start with, we'll start with low voltage. <laughs> low voltage lightning bolt, yeah? Yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I think lightning is sort of you're either not there or it's rather high. Well, it's either way. That's what I'm going with. So everyone just move along. <laughs> okay. Well, you know, people need, well, you need to uh, harness the power to get rid of everyone's annoying habits. And obviously, me being Mr. Perfect, um, <laughs> I have the perfect answer. And, you know, you might not sort of. Uh, sort of get it to begin with but don't worry I'll explain you need it's cool you mosquitoes alright <laughs> okay now um, now hear me out as I said you know it's not it's not a normal one but you get the people you hate and you just put them in a room full of mosquitoes and you, sh you say to them you ain't coming out until your problems are sorted and you know they're being bitten and all the <laughs> all around their ears it's just going to drive them crazy. That and is a fucking amazing mosquito impression. I know. And anyway, so, because uh, obviously I'm Mr. Perfect, so I do wow, everything. he really oh, is perfect. He is. Saying. I don't lie to you guys. So, yeah, you put them in a little room, and you just say, look, you've got to sort your shit out. <laughs> and if they don't, I mean, they're just going to get, like, what's that, Ebola or some shit? I don't know. Malaria. <laughs> Malaria. Oh, <laughs> do. Zika virus, yep. So Zika's the new one now. They get that small brain syndrome. Sorry, and lightning was harsh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, these well, are now both. I can put Zika virus in our tags. Bring it in all those good viewers. Horrible <laughs> ideas. I'm, I think my idea is um, you know, it's, the, uh... it's. You know the Zika virus. I've I've got one question. Right, what's it going to do to the one size fits all cap market? Oh. <laughs> Expand it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh Jesus. my god. You're fucking horrible, Scott. Oh. It is a genuine sort of like troubling thing in the African regions. Brazil, isn't and it? you're just taking the piss out of it. You're making making isn't jokes. It in Brazil? Oh, Zika was thrown to South America. It's alright. It's alright. All these South American Again. subscribers will just trying, leave. Okay. Trying, to get on, trying to get on his high horse about it and he doesn't know where <laughs> it is. I'm disgusted. <laughs> I'll, I'll bring um, it over everyone there. should unsub to you. Okay. Yeah, exactly. If you, if you want clean sub, you know, clean material, come to Sir Night Owl. Or, <laughs> I get unsub real quick. Or use that joke at work tomorrow. Yeah. Goes down a tree. <laughs> <laughs> right, so let's say the mosquitoes aren't uh, what cuts it for me. What else do you guys have? Um, I think my idea is it's not um, going to kill someone or give them a life-threatening disease and let them wither away until they die. <laughs> I'm going to suggest you plop a sombrero on their, their head while their annoying tick kicks in because then it will be totally random, throw them off guard completely, and that will stop their uh, annoying ha habit. Admittedly, you have to carry a lot of sombreros around, but then, you know, once you, you plop it on there... They're going to be confused as hell. So, I'm sorry, I've got some really crap cards. I was going to say, in, in their defense, I feel like I would enjoy it so much I would try to get as many free sombreros out of this deal as possible by improving my take and doing it more. 
Well, uh, yeah, you might have got me there. Um... Oh, okay. Fuck. <laughs> right. Okay. Well, you've heard the crap ideas. Get ready. Oh, man, I'm excited. Tweezers. Oh, God. No death. No <laughs> horrible fetal defects. <laughs> no terrible fashion hats. Just straightforward aversion therapy. Tweezers. Somebody starts doing their bad habit. Nip him in the back of the arm. Works like 80% of the time. Sorry, I can't believe you said nip, nip him in the back of the arm and you didn't follow up with works like a charm. Oh, <laughs> so disappointed I missed it. I missed well, instead, it. he diminished his own thought by saying it only works 80% of the time. I mean, it meant 100%. 100%. I'm going to point out that lightning always strikes once. <laughs> I don't know what that means. <laughs> what? What? <laughs> 60% of the right. time, it works 100% of the time. That's what I was going for, and I fucked it up. <laughs> well, there you well. go. There you go, Teach. All right, wow. So this is some hard ones to choose from. So if I also had to do what <laughs> Scott did and go from, you know, smallest to greatest, I'll probably have to give the least to some burrows. And that's simply because you just gave up after some burrows. <laughs> yeah. So you're going to give... Clown Lightning, man. mosquitoes, and tweezers are all pretty good. I mean, I mean, giving them an illness might not fix their habit, though. Well, that might die. Just... Yeah, it gets rid of the habit, to be fair. Well, yeah, quite effectively. What if they and also, if you don't like the person, that's it. Why do you bet, like? But it doesn't necessarily kill them, and it's not always right away either. I mean, if I want to kill them immediately, lightning will probably do that trick for me. <laughs> tweezers does have a sun around it, after all. I'm gonna make the assumption. It's like something's calling me over towards it. Uh, yeah, they don't have to go with lightning. Because yeah. tweezers works 80% of the time. Mosquitoes uh, might do the trick. Lightning's just gonna kill them. And that, that gets will... rid of that habit. But that's not getting rid of... Well, it is. Well, the habit's gone. Yeah, but you just might as well kill the person. You're not You're not really helping the person well, in any way. if you had a gun, I might have picked that one. But I had sombreros. It totally throws Smother them off their game. them with a sombrero. Uh, my my Zika boy is crying. Because <laughs> you didn't pick him. Oh, Sorry, oh. who won? What's going me, on? Me. Not one. What, with um, lightning? Yeah, because he's a killer. He's a murderer. Oh, excellent. All right, murderer. Well. Did you see me though? Oh. 
did the shit I did.